It's your boy Odin from Host.Promo. In today's video, we're going to be reviewing Fathom Analytics. If you haven't heard of Fathom Analytics, it is a new analytics platform that you can self-host yourself and it's open source and it's very simple and it's focused on privacy and not storing any information about your users. And it has gotten quite popular, so I wanted to go ahead and review it. And I also wanted to show you how to install it. And I'm going to have a link in the description to digitalocean.com and it will give you $100 credit. And in their marketplace, they have a one click install for Fathom Analytics. So it's very easy to set up. Okay. So all we need to do is spin up a server. We're going to spin up the cheapest one possible, $5 a month, and you're going to get $100 credit with that link. And you can pick your location. We'll go ahead and do Germany for now. Make sure my SSH key is added. That's monitoring as well. Host name. Okay, we're good to go. Click create. It's going to go ahead and spin up that server. Now, while we wait for that server to spin up, I will go ahead and show you a preview of what their analytics looks like. So it's very simple. It shows the unique visitors, the amount of page views, the average time on the site, the bounce rate, and then it shows the top pages your website is your website visitors are going to and it also shows the top refers one thing that i found very interesting and very cool is if you press the left arrow key on your keyboard it will go to the previous time period okay so if you're on one day it will go one day back okay and if you're on four weeks will do about a month at a time and you can just press left right and it'll go through them okay so it's pretty cool and you can also break it down hourly daily and it's just very simple and the purpose of it is to not store your website visitors information so they have full privacy and you can see what pages people are going to and where traffic's coming from and just the basics okay now that our server spun up, we're going to go ahead and copy the IP address. We're going to pop open a terminal. Let me head and zoom in so you guys can see. We're going to do SSH root at and then the IP address. It's going to ask if, if we want to confirm. We just go ahead and type yes and hit enter. And it's going to ask us some questions. Will you be pointing a domain at this Fathom instance? We're going to go ahead and type in no. And let me go ahead and zoom out just a little. It's a little hard to see. Please enter the domain subdomain you want to use for Fathom. I don't want to use anything right now, so I'm just going to press enter. Wow, it's forcing me. Are you serious? Uh, let me go ahead and see if I can just use the IP address. Do you want to password protect your Fathom stats? We'll do yes. Enter an email address for this user. Test at test.com. Enter a password. Test123. Test123. One, two, three. Test, one, two, three. You can access Fathom at and then the IP address. Okay. Because remember, I did the IP address as the domain name, but you may want to put it at like stats dot and then your domain name. And then you're going to have to go into DigitalOcean or whatever, wherever your domain is and just change the A record. It's very easy. OK, so now let's go to this IP address. And let's see what it looks like, people. It's loading, it's loading, it's loading. Hopefully it looks like this, but it's probably not going to have any data at the beginning, so it may look a little strange. I'm going to go ahead and pause it while it's loading. All right, it's done loading, so we'll do test at test.com and test123. We'll sign in, and it says add a new site to track your Fathom, okay? And I don't really think this matters what you put it, so we'll just keep it as is and click create site. And now you see it gives us the code that we need to embed in our site, okay? So you would basically copy this code and you would put it into your site and then you're good to go, okay? And then your site is gonna be starting to be tracked 
And there you go, people. That's how you do it. It's very simple. And once you have data, it will look a little bit something like this. And it looks like you can even add multiple websites. So that's really cool. So you could have multiple websites all on the same IP address. Okay, you guys, and make sure to go to the link and you will get $100. And all you have to do is click Create, Droplet, and then click Fathom and you'll be good to go. And I hope you enjoyed this review. I think Fathom Analytics is pretty cool. It's pretty simple. If you just want to know the basic analytics of your website and you care about your user's privacy, it's pretty cool. And also one other thing, guys, if you come to this website and you see this pricing, this is if you want to store on their servers, okay? And that doesn't really make sense because you can use DigitalOcean and do it for much cheaper, okay? So yeah, guys, if you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to comment, make sure to subscribe. Make sure to check out Fathom Analytics and make sure to use the link down below to get started with your $100 free trial. Peace out.